Hey everybody, happy Thursday. Meteorologist Dave Downey here. Snow wrapping up across much of southern and central Iowa. We've got a little bit in Des Moines, uh, less than an inch. Some places in southern Iowa got between three and four inches, especially closer to the border uh, of Iowa and Missouri. We're going to stay cold through Saturday, though. Highs in the 20s and the 30s. But big changes come by Sunday, warming up into the 50s. Then later on uh, next week into the 60s, maybe 70s as well. And we look pretty dry, too. There's a chance in the 10-day forecast for some rain or some storms. And we'll take a look at that here in just a moment. Wind gusts are going to increase tomorrow. It's been pretty quiet in the wind department today, even with all that snow. But a cold front's going to work its way in overnight tonight into tomorrow morning. You can see that wind shift, winds out of the north in northern Iowa, winds out of the southwest in southern Iowa. That pulls its way through in the morning hours. That keeps us cold for tomorrow and for Saturday. Wind gusts between 25 and 30 miles per hour pretty much throughout the entire state you see here tomorrow before they back off a little bit, not completely uh, by Saturday. Look at the jump in the temperature department Saturday into Sunday. Lots of sun really all three days. More, uh, all three days we're going to see more sun than clouds, that's for sure. Jumping up 25 degrees from 33 on Saturday, close to the 60 degree mark by Sunday. So a tale of do two different halves. Uh, this weekend, but that's not before we get through the coldest night. Uh, hopefully for the rest of winter. We don't want to jinx that just yet, uh, but Friday night into Saturday. Look at this wind chills dropping below zero. Northern and eastern Iowa will get into the double digits below zero, and that feels like temperature department. We stopped it here at 7 a.m. Pretty much the entire state feeling like below zero on uh, Saturday morning with air temperatures. Uh, just above zero, five degrees is the forecast uh, low temperature for Saturday morning. Going to jump up to 58 by Sunday afternoon, so a weekend whiplash, that is for sure. The jet stream is going to lift very far north by Sunday into Monday and Tuesday. It's going to really allow much of the upper Midwest, including Minnesota, Wisconsin, to see some of the warmest temperatures so far uh, this season. You see the jet stream pushes all the way back into Canada. Wednesday will likely be our warmest day next week, and that will really roll on throughout next week as well. We're kind of in the bullseye here for the uh, above average temperatures uh, for March 16th through the 20th, so that 6 to 10 day range for next week. 16 tonight as skies clear out, winds will pick up overnight tonight. Winds between 10 and 20 miles per hour, gusting to 30. Highs about 15 degrees below average, around 30 degrees tomorrow. Here's your Hope Plumbing Heating 10-day forecast. Don't forget to spring forward uh, Sunday morning. That's uh, uh, Spring forward brings us our spring-like temperatures for Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday. 50s turn into 60s. Next weather system could arrive by St. Paddy's Day, uh, but we'll keep an eye on it.